Hello and welcome back to the 25Ks in GeoGuessr. Today on our, I think about fourth European tour uh, during this series, we're going to be going to the United Kingdom. Uh, we're going to be playing Wolf Trekkers map, um, which apparently includes Northern Ireland, but not the Isle of Man and Jersey. Reasons for that, I don't know. I can, I mean, I can sort of maybe understand Jersey not being included. I don't really know why the Isle of Man is not included. But either way, it's got more than 8,500 handpicked locations, so it should be good enough to, to give us five locations. Um, as you can see there, I've played the map before, apparently. Not that I have any memory of it, but I didn't get a 25k, so we're going to increase our score here. What's in terms of friends list? If we could get under 10 minutes, that would be great. Probably not going to happen. I'm not the biggest fan of the UK and GeoGuessr, but we'll see. Maybe we'll get a nice seed. Um, so let's start without a time limit. Let's start in three, two, one, go. Let's see. All right. Yep, that's what I expect of the UK. Uh, what was that? Just, yeah, plant and tool hire. Right. Let's start going down the road. We could be here for a while. Uh, the UK is definitely one of those places where getting 25k could take you like, as you saw, 10 minutes if you get lucky, or it could take you two hours if you get unlucky. You're going to see what uh, case is for us today. Just from judging landscape, I can't really tell mostly where I am in the UK. I mean, you know, there's some places, uh, Spa Mount. Uh, okay. Uh, there's some places in Wales and Scotland where you're like, okay, this is definitely one of those. But other than that, difficult. Oh, Castle Dirk. Funnily enough, I know exactly where it is. Uh, and I'm going to tell you why. Because um, playing in Mr. Blue's uh, Map Battle League, and I just had to play Northern Ireland. And there was literally a, a round uh, right here, somewhere here. Um, so I, there was a sign to Castle Dirk there, so I know where that is. Uh, four kilometers to Killen, Killen is here, uh, seven to Drumquin is probably down there somewhere. Don't know where exactly. Oh, there's Spa Mount. Uh, so let me go back to that sign. Let me see what the road name was. This was the Drumnaby Road. Oh, it went north. That's interesting. So is this road here. Okay. How far away were we from Spa Mount? I mean, this must be Spa Mount then. And we're just about... I think we're probably close to this, actually, yeah. Let me just check if the other side of this comes back around as well. Uh, it should be here then, right? Yeah. Potentially. I'm not entirely sure, though. Uh, actually, never mind. Is it just this little thing here? It might be just this little thing here. Just go over there, come back around here. Yeah, that might be, might be true. Should be true. Could be somewhere like down here. It'd be this house here. Maybe even further down. Um... Or it would be this house. I mean, you can't really tell. There's a couple houses missing on the map, which is slightly annoying. Actually, though, I feel like this... Like, this distance from here to over there is less than 25 meters, 100%. So if I just place it relatively close to here, it should be fine. Do I want to confirm anything else? Don't think it's necessary. Uh, or actually, wait a second, I'm dumb. This is it. I don't know what that was, but yeah, that makes more sense. Yeah. Uh, should just confirm things. Yep, yep, yep. I was kind of confused, though, because if you look at the road, like, there's a clear curve there um, after this turn. Like, there's a clear curve, like, here. And that doesn't appear here. So I was a bit confused, but... Just by the, the side road, it had to be here, obviously. Um, so, all right, that was round one. I knew the place uh, we had assigned to, so that helped. 
Uh, it definitely could be more difficult in the UK, though that probably won't be either, considering we're in a city. Although cities aren't exactly my favourite either. We'll see. Do we have anything on the roundabout? No. Nothing significant on this. What do we have here? Uh, okay. Nothing that tells me the city. Milton, next Gravesend. I've heard of Milton, but I have no idea where it is. Uh, St. Joseph's Preparatory School. Nope, nothing there. Right, let's continue. Although, do I want to just have a quick look? Because I think Milton might stand out enough to see it. I mean, there's Milton Keynes, obviously, but that's not the Milton I'm looking for. At the same time, that might be why I think I've heard Milton before. There's no uh, guarantee that it wasn't that. Okay, maybe we'll continue on after all. Um, there's got to be a sign eventually once we get out of the city. What do we have here? Nothing important. Or maybe it would have been, but I couldn't have read it anyway. Out here, Valley Drive. Nothing interesting. Yeah, usually uh, cities in the UK don't put their city name too often. Uh, close to the A2. Uh, the A2 would be here. Not too far away from Dartford. Where is Dartford? There is Dartford. Okay, we're really close to London. Where's Milton? Uh, there's Northfleet. It should be somewhere around here. There's Gravesend and there's Milton. Okay, it's not even an actual city. It's a part of town, essentially. What do we have here? Just a road named Leaf Park Road. Is that worth looking for? Will I find that? Mm. Depends on how much of this is Milton. I could be able to find it, but... I mean, there's Valley Drive. Didn't I have that somewhere? Um, but I don't see that. Actually, could it be that road? Maybe. There's a Chinese takeout. I saw that. I don't know if it's if it's the same Chinese takeout that I saw. Chances are probably not too high. What road have we got here? Parrock Avenue. Um, I see that somewhere. Also, no. Maybe all of this is Valley Drive, and I never left Valley Drive in the first place. Um, possible. Apparently not true, though. What else? Uh, Bronte View. I haven't found anything yet that I recognized on the map. This doesn't really tell me anything. Looks like we're more or less entering the town now. Getting more populated around here. Welcome to your local walkthrough testing sites. Okay. Uh, there's Parrock Street. Okay. Let me think what makes sense. Arrack Street. Look. Is it in Gravesend itself? It's Princess Street. Can't hurt to take a look. No, it doesn't look like it. Hmm. This is an interesting one. I'm having trouble finding it. Peacock Street, almost. There's Parrock Road. But we want Parrock Street, don't we? Hmm, but there is Leaf Park Road and there's Parrock Avenue. So despite us actually wanting Parrock Street... This should, oh, there is Parrock Street. Okay, fine. We've got it. 
Uh, it's sort of in the curve here. Where do I put my marker? Here. Uh, should be about there, right? There's like one, two, three, like here. That should be it. Yep. Make your guess. Nice three mises. Took a bit at the end there, but also not too bad. What do we have in this round? We've had Northern Ireland, we've had the UK, or obviously uh, England, um, and Bridge in 11. I'd like some, some Wales and Scotland as well. Would be nice. Dramara branch office. Dramara doesn't sound um, very English. Sounds Northern Irish again. Do you want to, what does that actually say? Say Lisbon? Let me have one look through Northern Ireland quickly. Uh, wasn't that somewhere over here? I don't remember. Dromara. There's Lisbon. And... It might be what it's written, what is written on that sign. There is Romara. Yep. Okay, two times Northern Ireland. That's a bit excessive. But sure. Wood Whale. Is there. And there's like one house here. Yeah, that looks about right. Just go a bit down here to confirm. There's a gas station. With a, a Eurospar, yep. All right, should be about here. Yes, nice two meters. That was an easy one. Again, just mostly based on language, actually. Which obviously helps. Um, <laughs> we're in a residential area. That's That can always be a pain. Trying to find your way out of this one. Uh, but this way looks decent. Usual advice, whenever you see something that turns into, you know, road lines, go that way. Probably the safest way to get out of a suburb like this. That way, and then I want to go, let's go north. Uh, the bus disappeared, which is a bit unfortunate. I wanted to have a look at that one. Right, that's a dead end, so we don't want to go there. How about this bus? The D and G bus. And it disappeared on me again. Of course. Right, there's another one. It's a slightly different kind of bus. Alright, it doesn't have any information for us. That's a nice little lake. Alright, I think we've made it to the city. This looks like a sign that might give us information. Newcastle under Lyme. Okay, the other Newcastle that's not here. Uh, I don't remember where it is. I... Oh, where is Nantwich? Is Nantwich over here? It's the A500, so it shouldn't be. It should be over here somewhere. Is Northwich? It's close. Oh, uh, where is Nantwich? Nantwich is not small. A500 and A525. Mm, 530, 523. Hmm. Gotta be somewhere around here. 520, 518, 515, 52, 511, 515. No, it's not here. Where else could it be? I mean, over here it already goes into the 60s. So it's got to be even smaller, I guess. Hmm. Actually, there's Newcastle on the Lime. It's hidden behind Stoke on Trent. Okay, the A500 leads there, which is this one. And where's the A525 then? I wonder, is that. No. It really only goes until here, which is very interesting. 
What else do I have? I've got Nantwich. Okay, that's Nantwich. That makes sense. Uh, okay, it's hiding behind crew. Right, I know I should probably find out what the town I'm in is called. Maidley. Is that the name of it? Mm. I don't see it right now. There's Red Bull. <laughs> uh, Maidley. Could also be like a suburb of crew. Uh, Williston or Wisterston. No Maidley here. Let's just go that way. I mean, it could be a, a suburb of Stoke as well, I guess. As to 527. Uh, is there a 525 anywhere here? No. Oh, there it is. Does that show up? It doesn't show up at all. There's Maidley. Okay. Right, it's a bit further south. Alright, so we're in Maidley. We came through Moss Lane. Uh, okay. Let me go back. There's Cherry Hill. I find that. Let me think. Yep, yeah, there. Makes sense. Then this one. Is it actually going to tell me what road this is? Um. Hmm. I don't know. I'm assuming this is Bramble Lee. But would I be able to read it? Yeah, actually, now, now that I know what it says, I, I can read it, yes. And it's in the second house, like... Uh, da, 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 here. Should be here. All right. Nice. Another four meters. And yeah, walked in a big circle. I don't know if it would have been quicker to go down here. I don't know if that would have been a good sign, but that definitely helped, even though the A20... Ah, it actually shows up here at this zoom level. But one further in, doesn't show up. One further out, doesn't show up. Yep, UK roads. One more round to go. Who's back house? So we've had two English and two Northern Irish locations. And this... Could be either of them, to be honest. It actually gives me more of like a Northern Irish feeling again. But let's see, New Biggin. That somehow sounds Welsh to me. Couldn't really explain why. Uh, but I think, let me see what this is. Nothing, absolutely nothing. Maybe this one is better. Useless signs. Let's see, that's sort of an... Well, it's just an intersection to... Uh, to the Dockwood Lodges. Okay. Probably uh, just, you know, holiday destination for people. I don't know what the <laughs> massive black circle under us is. Being dragged down to hell, apparently. But we're just about escaping. Okay, I mean, is that the coast or is that a lake? It looks more like the coast to me. Let me actually set a checkpoint and try to go the other way for a bit. Yeah, that definitely looks like the coast. New begin. The problem is that the UK doesn't exactly have very little coast. Got quite a bit. I don't want to just start randomly searching for some place called New Biggin that might be super small. What have we got down this road? Looks like we'll enter another small village over there. Can I read this? Meadowlands, Carolyn Park. Might be a PY on the map, but again, that's even worse than New Biggin to look for. What was that? Okay. Sure. Now, where is the biggest pirate population of the UK? And there's not a lot here. Uh, no, owning vehicles. 
coast seems to be mostly towards the south and east. Uh, which <laughs> excludes about 10%. Uh, Barrow, near Barrow. Now, where was Barrow again? I mean, it's a five. A number with five again. Uh, was Barrow in, in Wales? I don't think it was, but it must be close. Oh, is Barrow up here? Yeah, there is Barrow. Barrow in Furnace. I hope it's the right Barrow. 5087. What else do we have? Rampside, Roar Island, and Peel Castle. Um, if I zoom out a bit more, can I see something? No. Um, I mean, I could look for New Biggin here. It doesn't look like it's... Oh, there it is. Yeah, I did say south and east, not south and west. Um, there's New Biggin. There's the Do Oh, Doewood, not Dockwood. Okay. Doewood Lodges. And we've apparently gone for a ruse back here, and then there's Ramp Side. Now, oh, there's the ruse back house. Um, does that actually appear somewhere? Doesn't look like it. Let me see. We go east over here. We take a turn to the north. And then we go east again. Then we go north again. Like, north, east, north. Maybe, but this also looks like it. This looks a bit better, even. But, looks a bit too populated, maybe, even. For this. Let me see if I can find one road name somewhere. Oh, there's the bus stop. The small kiln road. Uh, makes sense for it to be. I'm assuming it is, yes. Um, so we must have started down here. Apparently there's, again, bus stops here. Oh, there it is. Never mind. I see it. Okay. Sure. We started exactly here. Nice. Got it done in 21 minutes 24 my timer and 20 minutes 53 in the Geogesser timer. Doesn't actually put me... I think it might put me in, in third place in my friends list, which uh, I'll take. Just over five minutes on most of these. Third one obviously was a bit quicker uh, in Dramara. And the first one, again, it obviously helped that I knew Castle Dirk. Other than that, yeah, not the worst seed. We didn't get England five times, which I'm very grateful for. Um, and the locations we got in the UK were sort of diverse as well. Like we had one on the coast, we had one sort of just in the middle of the country, in the middle of nowhere, and we had one uh, relatively close to London, sort of a very urban area. And then two Northern Ireland locations, um, yeah, that were pretty... One in the absolute middle of nowhere and one in a relatively rural town. But those were quite nice as well. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed uh, the UK 25k. Uh, thanks for watching. I'll see you guys again next time. Bye.